She is a fresh one today, guys. What's going on? How's it going? I'm starting the video in the truck because it's super cold outside and yeah, just chilling. It's warm. So a bit of a random day. I've kind of been off the social media for the last few days. I haven't posted many stories. Just kind of been laying low and you know, getting ready for Christmas and my birthday. My birthday's coming up, December 20th. Uh, so when the, this video will probably be up Friday. So my birthday's on Sunday. So yeah, I'm excited. Big 31, getting old. Uh, and I got my hair cut. Anyways, I'm at my favorite store today. As you can see, Princess Auto. The store where you can pretty much get anything. Really random. London just went into code red, phase red. Basically lockdown. And I just drove by Costco. And there's probably at least 2,000 cars in the parking lot. It makes no sense whatsoever. I am so sick of this and over it. I'm sick and tired of being sick and tired. Anyways, I'm just going to keep filming and having fun. So, got to swing by here. You got to swing by the farm. Pick up some packages. And then I'm picking up a Jeep in Tilsonbury. I think it's a Jeep. Pretty sure it's a Jeep. So, I'm heading down to Tilsonbury. We did have a lot of snow this morning. Well, not really. It was like maybe a little light dusting. And as you can see, it's gone now. So... Let's head into Princess, buy some randomness, and then just throw some kilometers on the old Platinum. The old 2020. I think I'll get a trader in soon because we're almost 20 with 21. So it is time to trade this old gal in. Bing! Start with this. New pressure washer hose. What else do we need? Wish I could just take everything. Take it all. These are the best coolers. I actually picked one up the other day. They're pretty much the same thing as a Yeti, but way cheaper. I'm gonna pick another one up. Christmas present. Ooh, you know, I love me some straps. You definitely take a couple of these. You never have enough straps in your life. Ah, look what they finally have. Deep socket set. I need one for my truck. And look, it's on sale. Ooh, another dog toy for Nala. This thing is incredible. It still hasn't ripped. I think I'll get her the, the old duck this time. It looks just as strong. What else we need? Zip ties. You can never go wrong with zip ties. Taking those. Any good stocking stuffers. Adjustable. Hmm. Take it all. Last but not least, some more paint. Which one do I want? We're scared orange non non grass marking paint. I'll go red. All right, let's get out of here. Back at the house. I haven't been here in a week, I think. So, parcel city. I love not coming here for a bit, and then. My dad always shoots me a message. She's like, hey, you got 19,000 parcels. That's what happens when you become a YouTuber. Everything just shows up. Don't even have to ask for it. This is from my grandma. She canceled Christmas, so it looks like she sent me my gift. This is from, don't know, Amazon. Probably a Christmas present I bought. And some banners and this is spice this is the costa rican spice that my dad brings back from costa rica it will change your life actually i think you can get it here online this is what it's called highly recommended i put it in scrambled eggs everything garlic toast freaking i put some in my hair you know keep me spicy so i open this stuff and show you what's in there and after playing with everything, I opened everything up and played with it. Thank you, Grandma, for the Christmas card. You are the best. I love you. Shitty cancel, uh, Christmas is canceled this year. But, you know, it's just the world we live in. I guess my birthday is canceled, too. So, Olight sent us a ton of stuff that came in random boxes. That's what that Amazon package was. Grandma sent a little gift for Laura, too. Anyways, they sent a Seeker 2. Um, it's similar to the M2R Pro. They sent another M2R Pro. It comes in orange now. So this is, or the Warrior Pro. This is my favorite light. 
Um, this is the Seeker. It's about the same size. I believe it's a little bit brighter. And uh, yeah, it just has basically all your same functions. A few different modes, except this one has, uh, like it shows you how bright you are and how, how much battery life you have left, so. And yeah, they sent this cool light, but it can't actually show it because they have not released it yet. They have not announced that they wanted me to release it. Then I don't know if they were having some issues with it, but they said, do not show it. So I can't show you, but it is pretty badass, guys. I just sent a snap to my friends. They thought it was badass. So, and then they sent this, the O-Bulb. So this would be really great for camping. Basically, it's just a mini light. Goes red, goes flashing red, and then dim and bright. So you can put that anywhere and so on. Then yes, the, the normal M2R Warrior Pro. I like this one because it has a clip on it, but it does not have a gauge to show you how much battery life is left. So I might just switch to the Seeker and give this one to my father since he always goes walking in the evenings and he needs a light. Also, I ordered these from Vistaprint. We need some banners. So I got a Team 408 one they had a sale on. So ordered three. I don't know if you guys have ever been on Vistaprint. No, I'm not sponsored by them, but I get a lot of stuff done by them and they always have sales on. So if you need any banners or whatever, they do quite good jobs. So, okay, enough ranting about that. Um, let's load up the trailer and get out of here. Go pick up that Jeep. Jeep, Jimmy? I think we're picking up a Jimmy too. Not today, but soon. There we go. Look at this thing. <laughs> the old Jeep. I think she'll be good to jump. She's limited. Oh, uh, yeah. Let's get her loaded up. <laughs> So you warm her up in Canada. <laughs> she is fresh out. <laughs> Burn it on the neighbor's driveway. <laughs> Classic. <laughs> Watch the platinum. <laughs> Lots of creeks. She's quite cold. Perfect. Right there? Good. Do burnout. It's all wheel drive like all the time. How'd you do a burnout there? I don't know. Try it again. Go up. <laughs> don't launch it under the platinum. Maybe try it in reverse. Ah. Well, I guess it was a one time thing on the neighbor's driveway. <laughs> Whew. Made her back to the farm. As you can see, it is dark outside. It's only about 6.30, but you know, it's winter and it gets dark at like, I think sunset's like 4.30, so she gets dark quick. Anyways, made her back. We got the Jeep. The Jeep's good to go. So we will continue this video tomorrow, obviously, because it's dark outside, you can't see anything. Jay is coming over, he's bringing side-by-side -side over, and so we got two four by fours now and we're getting one more. I'm picking up, I think it's a Jimmy or a Blazer on Friday. So we'll have three four by fours and we'll try and keep them for a few months for the snow. Cause obviously cars don't work very good in the snow, snow and mud. So I'm just going to unhook this and head home. So we'll see you guys in the morning. <laughs> oh my God, it's cold windy today. Ooh, someone got a wash. Why is this thing here? It's winter, why do you bring this thing over? Oh. Watch, hit the wheel well. Oh, that's quite fit. Apparently there's a whole bunch of mud under a skid plate and I gave him a new winch rope, but that doesn't look like the new winch rope. At least everything's frozen frickin' rock hard. 
as you can see, snow has melted. We got a little light dusting yesterday, but Rick and Jay drive across the dead lawn. Fresh out. Christmas is cancelled, at least for my family. And my birthday's pretty much cancelled too, so my dad's gonna give me a cake today. It's birthday week for me. I'm excited. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Marky. <laughs> Happy birthday to you. Okay, make your wish and blow the candle out, Mark. Okay, there you go. And cut the first piece. Nice. There you go. Happy birthday, Mark. Thank you. <laughs> it is chilly today. I mean, if it wasn't windy, it wouldn't be too bad, but it's super windy, so. I'm frozen. I'm frozen solid. Thank God for our car. It's keeping us warm. So we're winching this thing up the tree. This is a tree I used to wash my side by side. But now this is the tree we're using to get all the mud and leaves out from underneath. What you got going on down here? Oh yeah, just full. Just full right? What happened to the new winch rope I gave you? You know what? I haven't had time to get it rig it on there. Oh my hand is freezing. <laughs> like a glove. Couple leaves in there, Jaybird. Oh, she's full. I have these drain holes right. They should have holes in the I think you need to drill more holes in the six. <laughs> That's all part of the game. This is the first time this has been off. <laughs> really, eh? Our shop is still good, maybe. <laughs> Whew, she's quite the machine. Bring her down. Can <laughs> Oh, the ground is frozen solid. <laughs> so this machine's actually wider than mine now. Mine's 69, this is 70, 71. These tires are super wide though. Are they? Try to block the wind here, it's tough. All right, let's go rip a Jeep. And down at the track. It is actually a lot nicer down here, the wind is going completely over us because we're in the valley. So, what do you think of this thing, Jaybird? It's a nice, it's a nice unit. It's Limited. Nice spots, but not bad. Supercharged. I don't know if it is. I don't think Twin it is. turbo. Twin turbo. She's got a bit of the cancer. Twin turbine. Oh, yeah. price level. So. Yeah. We might. We could jump a car today. It's nice and hard. You, you yeah. Get up there. And it's not super windy down here, which is nice. I'm sorry for the wind noise before. But yeah, so let's get this thing off the trailer, take it for a little rip. We got this four by four. We got the GMC over there that the window doesn't go up. She rips pretty good too. She's four by four. What do you have to jump here? The Cavalier. It looks in nope, that's a Saturn. It looks in rough shape. That's a Cavalier. Yeah, she's flat tires, but that thing rips. Huh. The red one, I don't know if it really rips anymore. Remember when Brad was here, he was oh, ripping yeah, it yeah. and then it kind of went, uh, limp limp mode so it looks we may be able to jump the saturn today we'll see it'll be a separate video from this one but uh i see we get that thing off and we go uh try and get the mitsubishi it's still in the uh in the birch over there so you got your yank em rope yank em rope yank, yank em rope. damn near kill him so and uh buddy's supposed to be coming to pick up cars soon i keep saying that but all these cars are still here are you leaving the bus there <laughs> i got no way of moving it you got an idea? Hey, we can let's hook up the Duramax to it, and we'll see what what, what what we can pull with it. Bring her down. Okay. We can hit the old frozen puddle there. It's getting traded in. Might as well use it now. Yeah, beat on it, right? Burn the tires right Burn off. The tires right off. Think you can walk across that puddle? Probably higher than The old Warren Mitchell mobile. This thing was a beast. <laughs> ah! Yeah. Oh no, you'll probably go almost go up to your knees. Yeah. Oh yeah, because we dug it out. Yeah. We'll hit her with the Jeep before you can really smash it. Yeah, we'll <laughs> oh. oh man, I can't believe the old Detroit diesel. 
She still runs. We should make the engine run away. Not today. Just, just start stuffing stuff right through the turbo. We'll see. I don't even think it has a turbo. To tell the truth. No. All right. Let's get this thing off the trail. Smash glass <laughs> under the seat. Oh my god. Ugh. It's in good shape though. The tint's beautiful in it. Come from Math Alley. Nice. <laughs> Only the best kind. Sounds good, eh? So we call a Canadian cold start. <laughs> <laughs> Got some juice. Thing's a ripper. Oh, here we go. Three wheels turning. I know. Hold on. You're gonna do it reverse. Watch the bumper. You're good. Holy! It's aggressive. Try to keep this one around for a little bit. It's hard to keep a good vehicle down here, especially one that's all-wheel drive. Oh, there he is. Oh, what is he doing now? Oh, didn't make it. Let's get over there. I just finished saying we can't even keep a nice vehicle down here. What did I lose? The drive shaft? You lost something. You only had two tires spinning on the last one. Oh yeah, snap the uh, drive shaft off. Oh. Really? <laughs> uh oh. Front wheel drive! See, I just said that. I'm like, we can't, we have an all wheel drive car. Rear wheel. Give her a nice burnout. Hey, I wanted rear wheel anyway. Hey, she's got some pep. Holy. Oh my 
nice, 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 nice. Nice. It makes a bit of noise, but uh... oh, we, they were good tires. <laughs> Holy! <laughs> she has a night along. <laughs> wow, she's a ripper. Oh man, thing's gonna fly. Told you. Yeah. Now is this rubber or is this dirt? Oh, yeah, it's dirt? She's dirt. You're yeah, she's good. She's not four by four anymore. But you know, it's it's. That's pretty, just the way it goes. It's a price to pay, you know. It's fine. I still got the Sierra and I'm getting a, I think it's a Jimmy Friday, so. Four wheel drive? Yeah. Nice. We just won't try and go over this because apparently it's half drive. That's a good hill. Yeah, it's a decent one. Carrie made it over. Only blew two axles. Of course, that's Carrie, right? Yeah, that was Sammy's trying to wheel it. <laughs> that's, uh, that's, should we get the truck going? Sure. Well, I'm going to take this thing to the puddle. And That's then fine. We'll get the truck going and we'll go try and get the Mitsubishi. Let's do it. All right. Okay. Hop in. Oh my God. He wants me to drive in this thing now. Wow, that thing's loud now. This thing's probably going to live here forever. Man, that thing is deep. He must have dug it out even more. Here he goes, right here. Nice. Hey, all he needs two wheel drive. I think you lost your fuel tank. <laughs> you ripped the whole thing apart right there. See that? Oh no, that's just the cover. Is it the cover? Yeah. Hey, look at the hitch. Beautiful hitch on this thing too. Hey, you smell that? Neither do I. It doesn't smell like gasoline. It smells good. Hey, Brad would want that hitch. You know what? You should take it off. It's a nice hitch. Yeah, so said, said no one for the last 30 hitches or so. <laughs> look how thick this ice Man, is though, eh? That was deep. Hey, that's about half the size. Now you're about what? One inch? Yeah. One inch? Yeah. That's pretty good. She's cold down here. Yeah, I dug it in last time I had the dozer down here. She's deep. We need to clear out these vehicles so we can come ripping through here yeah. again. That thing is probably going to live right there forever. Oh, I understand. I don't yeah. know how we're getting rid of it. It's a party shack. All right, let's fire up the old uh, Sierra and uh, see rip the old bits. Let's do it. And the Sierra life. Thank God for the no coat. As per usual. Brings me back lots of memories. Farm trucking, oh, yeah. beer touring. Fire away. We got some lights. Cold start. Well, this pop off. Come on. We got dual exhaust on this thing, one, one in front, one behind. <laughs> Don't be breaking drive shafts, Jay. I, I already clipped the Durango with the back of this. It had a nice box on it, but not no more. R for race. Back wheel's gonna pop right off the bead. There's flying everywhere. Don't 
It'll knock the windows out on the platinum. <laughs> That's a beast indeed. I'm glad it's not too breezy down here. It's definitely way too cold up on the farm, but it's nice. We won't have too much wind noise. Uh huh. Where's he going? She's stalled. Uh oh. All right, see you later, Jay. <laughs> Is it actually not open? <laughs> uh, go through the go through the passenger door. <laughs> uh, well, let's pop the head. See if we can start this thing up again. You have to come through this door. Is it open? Well, just hand me the noco. I'll just stay in here. Yeah, it looks warmer in there anyway. He escaped. P.S. I got it. <laughs> Fire it up. We better conserve gas. Yeah, because there's no fuel. <laughs> Dude, you should see we were doing donuts. The tire was like about to blow off the bead. Really? I'm just waiting for a chunk of dirt to go through the window in my truck. Well, that's why I went yeah, I figured. All right, let's go pull that mitts out. Take her wide, you know. This way? No, you'll probably see the path of where the Mitsubishi went. There's a lot of different paths Yeah. Here. She's somewhere, yeah, I think it's right back through here, yeah. Sure. Right here? Yeah. <laughs> Just watch out for the giant boulders I put everywhere. Then go that way. I know there's a trench somewhere here, a couple big rocks, there's a rock. You have to go that it. way. There's a big rock. I forgot the Mitsubishi was back here. Ow! There's my head. I'd go through there. Yep. Take all those little trees out. Yep. Ah! Oh, there's a rock. Alright. Hey, watch the paint, eh? This thing's new. Fresh paint. Paid 250 bucks for this thing. Okay, we're gonna back up here somewhere. Yeah, you're gonna have to back up there, Jamer. Okay, let's go this way. Oh, don't be getting hung up now. No, I don't want to both get stuck back here. Where are we going? Are you just gonna, here, drive right around. Huh? That way. Well, that's victory. Our for race. Our for race. Well, it doesn't say anything over there. <laughs> oh, yeah, there's nothing on the dash, eh? Yeah, pop right through there. This seat is definitely wet. I can feel my butt getting <laughs> chilled to the E. Okay. Look at that thing. Still got the stencil on her. Good, man. All right. I don't know where we're gonna go, and that thing doesn't have steering either. Somebody, not gonna name any names. We can go right through here, probably. <laughs> yeah, somebody. All I know is you're gonna have to be fast about it. Just rip every. Oh, you're getting out. Hold on. I'm getting. You're gonna hold on. You're gonna rip the door off. <laughs> All right, go forward a little. Okay. The Yankum, still here. So. Yeah, this thing came flying through here, it nailed that tree, and it rolled over into that one. And the steering is pretty much gone, out. not pretty much, there is no steering. So, we have to basically drag it out, and hope it doesn't get caught on any of these trees. That's good! Ah, get the Yankum. This is the Yankum rope, if you guys need a tow rope, this is your one, 19,000 pounds. Yankum. All right, Jay, let's figure this out. <laughs> Where are we going? <laughs> I don't even know. <sighs> we have planned the route. It's gonna try and dart through here, but I have a feeling since it's facing that way, it's gonna hit that tree. Barely any gas in this thing. All right, floor it, floor it. <laughs> yep. Uh huh. See if we still had the Jeep, we could have used both. Ah, she's still. 
All right, no go time. Round two. Let's try and break this Yakim rope. Oh, jeez, that's a good run. <laughs> She's going. The three there. I didn't like that page anyway. Uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> this should be the fun part. Oh, there's the rad. I think we're gonna have to reposition, Jay. That's a good rope. Can't believe how much it stretches. Hey, Jay. We're gonna have to reposition. This... Whoa, who put that tree in there? <laughs> I know. We cleared the one that I thought we were going to hit and we hit this one. Yeah. That's not going to work. No, I think we yank her. You know what's good about this rope? Dude, I'm, should... I'm waiting for the like the initial... Mm, but there's nothing. Dude, in you it. should see how much it stretches. It's that's insane. Amazing. Highly recommend you yank them ropes, that's for sure. Wow. Yeah, uh, it's even frayed a little on the hood, but... No issues other than that. Um, I think we should maybe yank it that way since we're just on the edge. Yank her a few feet. So maybe take it off and back in here. I'll throw another floor mat on here. See, it's, it does have a guard, but it's not long enough for what we're doing. So I'll just use a floor mat. Round three. I still can't believe that rope. That's pretty incredible. Fire away. Tell me when to stop because I'm going full gusto. Full gusto. Go. You good? Yeah. <laughs> oh, he lifted the back end up. Do it more? Yeah, yeah, back right up. Keep going, keep going. Oh, yeah. Fire away. <laughs> this rope, I am blown away right now. I figured we would have got the rain straps already. Yeah. Outside <laughs> Good, we cleared one tree. This thing. Yeah, we've got airbags in there. All right, keep going. Wide open. Wide open. Okay. At least we can cut the cat off now. We on that. Uh, did we? But it's away from the hood now, so I don't know. Yeah, whatever. Let's just try and get her out in the open here. Back up though. Hey, you could probably go through here now. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> oh, this tree. <laughs> and that tree. Turn to your left. Your other left. There you go. <laughs> ah. <laughs> Apparently the box was not so well anyway. Be careful with that rock. <laughs> you caved in the box. She's just junk. Are we going straight now? Yeah, maybe go straight. Watch that rock though. Yeah. That one over there. All right. Good. Good. Yeah! So you got a battery here. <laughs> oh man. I'm gonna have to clean up a few things over here. One more full pull. Yeah, she doesn't roll really well on its roof. It's weird. All right, I think we can flip her back over now. Up, oh, whoa! You're up on a tree. Oh, 
I think we should flip it back over now and then we'll we'll drag it out through here. Slowly does it, Jay. We're literally doing this with no fuel. No fuel. <laughs> <laughs> it always works. My ideas are the best. Whoa! See, this GMC was a good investment. Not many people get to say that. As long as it helps me at least once, that's all I care about. Boom! <laughs> If anyone needs some tires, they're right here. Good to go. All right, we'll clean up all this crap and we'll see if we can actually drag it through the clearing now. I just can't believe this rope. Definitely, definitely amazing. For how for how far you were backing up and wide open, I figured it would just snap. Man, I'm amazed. <laughs> all right, let's pick up some batteries and uh, see if we can. <laughs> yeah, see if we can get her out of here now. Since we hit every tree on the way out. Let's see how she goes. Well, the state looks good back there. Yeah. Yeah. Keep that momentum going. <laughs> Gonna hit a tree. Oh, yeah, no problem. Full pull. Yep. Blue cup around a tree. <laughs> this thing just doesn't wanna. Yo, I don't know if that Jeep would have pulled this thing out. Oh yeah! Thank God for that rope. She's got some good stretch in her. <laughs> Just caved her in. Hey, you can start going left now. Yeah! Look at her fly! <laughs> the old Sierra. <laughs> Shrapnel everywhere over here. <laughs> I feel like it's going to roll once more. <laughs> Called it! Ah, we just picked all that stuff up! <laughs> oh. So funny. There. I'm like, I bet it's going to roll once more. <laughs> Yeah, I know. Well, I get, can, can we you pull? We just picked all that up. That's what I just said. Can, uh, will that rope come out or is it wedged? Oh. Bag her up. Just loop her over the top, yank her, and flip her over. Come on, Mets. Yeah, this is the last time I'm picking stuff up. <laughs> hey, if Highway Through Hell wants to hire me, I mean, I'm available for extra work. <laughs> oh, man. All right, let's drag it over there and then we'll call her a day. Let's pick the stuff up first, so. though. Yeah. One last time. One last rollover. Stand her up. Oh, I'm just going to ram right here. Don't flip. Yeah, 
exactly where we want it, right there. A little more. All right, that's good. Whew, I go red my hand is from not wearing a glove. <laughs> Now if you get this rope out. I just can't believe how much it's bent the the pillars. <laughs> this is the rope. You know, the mats are a good idea. Oh yeah. I've snapped many straps before, so we don't really need to snap this. No. Here, just pull that. Another key to add to the pile. Yanker through. This All right. Norco, it's a must have. Like, yeah, the Yankum. And there is a discount code below if you guys want to check them out. They have all different size ropes, so. All right, let's smoke that puddle with the Sierra and then uh, maybe start a new video, see if there's time. Yeah. Well, glad we finally got that dealt with. Huh, I think there's still time for another video today. Maybe jump the old Saturn. It'd be cool if it kind of went off and just nailed that. I know everyone wants to see that. I'll be shooting rocks through the platinum. <laughs> Things just fall apart. Good little truck though. Got us to where we need to go. I don't know those tires have popped up. Probably get some more gas for it though. Originally I didn't know how much was in it, so I just threw 10 liters in it at the gas station. Apparently it didn't have any in it. Where are we? Side back there. Come here. Come here. Come here, Jay. Come on. Yeah, I'm home. It's still in two by 104. Don't stall out now. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay. One more time. Go this way, though. Okay. Come from this way. Okay. Maybe I'll take the platinum next to it. Couple hundred bucks, guys. It's all it takes to buy one of these cars, and then you can have so much fun before they head to the scrapyard. <laughs> uh, all right, let's get down from here. Not fall on my face. Woo! Breaker right there. Oh, he's going through it. <laughs> Easy there. Oh. Sparker right here, actually. Well, at least you got a good wash. That'll do. That will do. Uh, anyway. Thank you guys for watching. I'm glad we had some fun there. I'm glad we got a new Jeep that is now 2x4. We're picking up that Freshie Friday. I was still this 4x4, so I'm going to try and keep the 4x4s for the winter. Just because obviously, you know, the cars don't do so well. So thank you guys for watching. Make sure you follow Razor J. That was don't, awesome. That was <laughs> that. Don't do anything we wouldn't do. Don't drive a Mitsubishi. And, um, don't flip it over because it's not safe. Yeah, look at the roof. All right, later.